Hey Cancer, welcome to another reading. This is T Priestess. This is just going to be a reading to see what the divine has for you. Okay? So we're going to see. All right. So I have divine, no, sorry, devotion, inner temple, um, Lumeria, creating, creating heaven on earth. It's happening. Leap, you go first. The universe will catch you. And at the bottom, get grounded. Also under that is trust the nickel. Um, so it's like the divine is asking you to get tuned in, like tune in, get grounded in whatever way that you need to. So um, if that's going outside, if that's like, you know, meditating or breathing, deep breathing, which I mean, I feel like a lot of people should do that, but um, you know, breathing in deep, just getting in tune with the divine, okay? So that way you can understand what's about to happen because you're about to need to take a leap and the divine is letting you know that, you know, I got you, but you're getting yourself ready to do that. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm getting. Um, all right, let me see what else comes out. Okay, yeah, the judge, judgment card and nine of swords. So, you were asking the divine or have been asking the divine, have been talking to the divine or the divine has been telling you like, you know, whatever you need to do, basically do that. Because if you don't, then you're not gonna be fulfilling what you need to do or like with this judgment and the nine of swords, it's like you're not gonna be fulfilling whatever you need to do and you're gonna be out here sad, basically. If you don't like get grounded and tune in to what the divine is trying to tell you. Yeah, queen of swords, so this is the energy you need to be in the queen of swords energy ace of wands just come out like you need to be in the queen of swords energy and get yourself out of the nine of swords energy because the divine is telling you look like it's happening like whatever you want or whatever is is you trying to get or whatever it's happening you just have to tune in and know that when it comes time to take this leap, you are protected, you are covered, and the divine has you, okay? Three of Cups came out, so you could be dealing with other people or worried about, like, I'm hearing, like, what's in other people's cups a little bit. I don't know, maybe not. Um have it works for you the sun also came out so yeah like that's where you're going from the judgment to the sun so it's like um all that in between with the nine of swords the three of cups the queen of swords and the ace of wands um it looks like steps like it's like you went from like god telling you like look look I got you, like, just believe, basically, just believe, and I got you, and then you, like, but really, like, how is this gonna happen, and you, like, how is this gonna happen, like, you crying in the bed, like, how is this gonna happen, and because, okay, I just got, like, because you want to, like, fill other people's cups up, 
you want to be able to give back you know i'm getting like charity donations things like that you want to be able to do this and the divine is saying like look you're gonna be able to you're going to be able to okay and then now it's like you get to the queen of swords energy where you like hell yeah i'm gonna be doing that shit. and then you take some action um I guess to get to the queen of swords energy, like you took the action to change your mind and get into the energy that you need to be in, that the divine wants you in. And then you get the sun, you get to the sun. And you did that with getting grounded and trusting the niggle. Mm -hmm. Trusting the niggle. And under that is unbound. So you released some contracts, some um, just release. You you have released yourself from anything that you don't need that was holding you back before. Or if you're going through this right now, you're going to release some things that was holding you back, is holding you back um, because you have to in order to get towards the sun. Yeah, see? Six of Swords came out. You have to leave whatever these thoughts, these this mindset um, could be people, whatever you need. Like, you need to leave that shit alone. Leave it in, in the back. Otherwise, you're not going to get to the sun. Like, you're not going to get there if you don't take these steps to get there. Like, the divine could be telling you, like, yeah. It's happening. Like, I'm telling you, it's happening. Even though you was in this energy or in this energy. But if you don't leave these thoughts behind, get out that mindset of like, no, this isn't going to happen. Then you're not going to be able to give like you want. You're not going to be able to do whatever you want to do out here. Like, the divine is telling you, like, leap. Like, you go first. You do what you need to do. And I got you. You know? So you stepped into this Queen of Swords energy. You like, hell yeah. You you said, hell yeah, I'm going to do that shit. The divine got me. Okay? And then you get towards the sun. Look. And then Knight of Pentacles comes. So you also, you know, money is on the way or resources. Something is on the way towards you because you got out of the mindset that you no longer needed to be in. Okay. Ooh. And then Page of Pentacles, it's going to be like a surprise. It's going to be like the divine just going to be like, here you go. <laughs> like, here you go. Here you go. Thank you for doing what I asked you to do. Thank you for removing those thoughts. Thank you for not thinking of yourself that way. Thank you for believing in me. Thank you for just thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. mm, I lost it. Oh, master of self. Okay, Cancers, y'all are out here mastering yourself. Through this process, you mastered yourself. Through this process, you mastered yourself. Okay, seven is understanding. You know, you came to a strong understanding about yourself um, to know that like, I am. I can do this. Like, if God is telling me that God got me, then why don't I believe this? You should and you will. And I love that. Look, I'm going to continue to blow my horn. And you hear how the horns is playing. You know, the divine always be getting it together. <laughs> okay, look, you're going to continue to blow your horn. You just had to figure some shit out or something. Like, you know. You had to figure some shit out. You had to figure some shit out with this devotion card. And then you was trying to find a way to be able to still blow your horn at the beginning. So whenever this was for you, um, or whenever you're going through this, I don't know how this works for you. I'm just putting it out there. Either this is like you already went through it, you're currently going through it, or you're about to go through it. And you're going to be like, fuck them people. Maybe people, well, okay. This is what I, you know, with these, with this card, the three of cups, it's like, you know, 
people could have been costing you or putting thoughts into your mind. You know, yeah, they could have been putting thoughts into your mind, you know, trying to get you to not believe that you could take that leap, not believe that you could listen to God. They was trying to stop your connection with God. They got you fucked up. Shit, fuck the people. Hell no, don't be doing that. Don't be doing that, okay? Look, 777 now, okay? If you don't know the meaning of 777, go look it up. Or you should. You don't have to, but whatever. <laughs> whatever. Um, Four also came out, so stability. Okay, so yeah, the stability starting to come because you put in the work on your number one self, okay? New beginnings is about to come now because you experienced this. You know, now it's happening. Now it's happening because you put in the work. Because you had to see cancer that, look, came in real quick. Like, like it, can't, it was a, a thought or something happened probably, you know, real quick where it was like, in order for me to get there towards the sun and the pinnacles, I literally do have to like, listen to God. I have to get rid of these thoughts. I literally, I just saw 11.22. I literally can't, you know, like believe whatever I'm believing. I can't allow these people to get into my mind because that's, that's all people can do really for real and you know you became stronger i'm hearing you became stronger than your mind you said fuck that my my thoughts are mine i'm leaving any anything that doesn't serve me behind that rhyme look okay <laughs> all right look these people look something was slow as hell <laughs> it could be people you know, not everybody's brain works fast. It, that's just true. Um, I'm not saying nothing, whatever, whatever. But some, not everybody's brain works fast. But it also probably could have been you who was like, for a second, like, you know, you were slowing your own self up. Slowing your own self up from, you know, understanding that everything is happening. Like, it's happening. You're creating heaven on earth. So you were slowing your own self up, Cancer. Well, that's it. I got the I got the that's it card. So yeah. You were slowing yourself up. Look at the bottom of this deck. Stop overthinking. You are already doing it. So you already doing it. You you were stopping yourself. Look, eight of wands is at the bottom of this deck. So it's like once you get out of that mindset. Everything is on the way, Cancer. You're literally, like it says, creating heaven on earth. You just have to tune into what the divine is telling you because that's what you need. That's who you need. That's what you need. Yeah, under the that sick card is upgrades and transformations. Excuse me. In order for you to get there to the upgrades and transformations, you just have to do all of this. You know, not too hard. <laughs> However it works for you, either you're doing it, you already did it, or you're currently going through it. So if you already did it, you know, now you're at a place where the divine is about to bless you. Like, it's just going to be like a surprise. Um, If you're working through it, then it's like, you know, you're working on leaving thoughts behind. If you are about to go through this then you know right now you are here asking god like well how do i get all the way over there like how do i get towards like this is on the way to me how do i get to where my mind is strong can't nobody bring me down i'm i'm going towards the sun like how do i get there so, yeah, however you fit, you know, fit yourself in. Um, you can book with me, book a reading if you want. Um, I do ask, there's two questions, two questions before booking because you have to check with the divine, okay? Look, divine is my nigga, okay? So it's like, we have an agreement. 
So, um, the first question, Divine, do I need to book a reading right now? That's the first question. The second question, if, if the answer is yes, um, when do I need to receive this reading? And then book for that specific date and time that the divine leads towards you. Okay. That's it. Okay, Cancers. I hope that you enjoyed, you know, as a fellow Cancer, myself, you know, I, I enjoyed this, you know, this puts some perspective. I, I can actually like notice this, like normally I don't see the readings as I'm going through it, it it's just coming out. I don't know how to describe that. But this re this reading, the divine like made me be like, I, I know what I've been saying. So, you know, the divine is talking to me too right now, like through this reading. Normally it don't work like that, but the divine was talking to me in the same reading with y'all. So yeah, I don't know if that makes sense to you, but it doesn't matter. Okay, bye y'all. I hope you enjoyed and I love you. Come back, bye.